Hi friends, what's so up? This is our crew from 360 Reader. It's time to learn how to see the moon calendar on iPhone, iPad, and Mac. Thanks to a recent update, you can access the moon module in the stock Apple Weather app on your iPhone, iPad, and Mac to view the lunar phase calendar, next new moon, full moon day, moon set, moon rise time, moon illumination, and much more. That said, let me show you how it's done the quick way. First and foremost, open the Apple Weather app on your iPhone or iPad. Now make sure that the app shows information about your location or you can switch to the desired city. Then scroll down and you will see a waxing Gibo style. This shows you the moon's illumination percentage, the next moon set time, and the number of days left for the next full moon. Moreover, you can tap on the Rexing Gibo style for more information such as moonrise and moon distance. You will also see the day and date for the new moon and full moon along with a beautiful and easy to understand monthly moon phase calendar showing its waxing and waning. You could also use the slider at the top to see the information for past and future times and days. Next up is time to learn how to see the moon calendar. On Mac. To get started, open the Apple Weather app on your Mac running Mac or Sonoma or later. Then select My Location or the Desired City from the left sidebar. Now scroll down to find the Rexing Gibo style showing details like the next moon set time. Then click on the Rexing Gibo style for more information like illumination, moon set, moonrise, next full moon, distance, lunar phase calendar, and new moon and full moon dates. Next, you can also use the top slider to change the time and day, and that's pretty much it. So that's how you can easily see the moon calendar on your iPhone, iPad, and Mac. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it, and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a good time. Bye-bye.